again. It's Tracy. Okay. I went to Ulta. <laughs> I'm a sucker. So, we're just going to go over what I bought today. I'm just doing all these little ones. I have... Hi! Isabel with me. I got a unicorn. Yes, she got a new unicorn to piggy bank. So, she's going to sit beside me and put all her pennies from her minion piggy bank into her unicorn piggy bank. You're not doing it. Oh, yeah, drop a couple <laughs> pennies on the floor so I can get those. Okay, fine. Okay, so, first, um, I'm going to grab my receipt. Because there were a couple of really good deals today. Um, so, I got the Real Techniques. I got a new makeup sponge, and it comes with the little towel folder. This was actually on sale. It was originally $6.99. It was on sale um, I got it for $4.89, so I really needed a new one. This is actually what I went originally for. <laughs> $50 later, I know it's not a big haul, but uh, $50 later when I go in for a makeup sponge and come out with a whole bunch of stuff. There's a little sponge, so we'll be using that, and it just goes into its little home. And when I do my makeup, I do use a, a damp beauty blender. Um, I just like it. I like it a lot better. And I also got um, two Wet n Wilds. I've got the um, matte finish setting spray. And this one I like. And then I also got the Color Icon Rainbow Highlighter. Yes, I'm... Okay, here we are. <laughs> so, we'll be seeing... You know, I, I've, I've fallen in love with highlighters, what can I say? And like this one doesn't want to come open. Um, I know Jeffree Star did a review on um, Wet n Wild on some of their products, and I believe there was, he was really impressed with their with the highlighter. Good heavens, there, come on, fingers. Okay, so... There's the highlighter. Feels a tad chalky. Um, it kind of, I don't know if you can see it. When it goes, it just kind of blends them all together. It's not blinding, but you know, it'll do. Okay, and these were on sale too. These were buy one, get one 50% off. So I paid $385 for the setting spray and for $63 for the highlighter. The highlighter was originally $599. The setting spray was originally $499. You can't beat a deal. And then, like I said, it's not a huge haul. I only got a few things. Um, I did get the um, Makeup Revolution London. This is their oil control fixing spray. Um, I do have really oily skin, so I want to try this. So this was kind of like a last minute purchase. But also by doing this, <laughs> I got a Phoebe. So this was, uh, this was $8 for, um, 3.38 of a fluid ounce. I don't know if I may be able to tell if there's any scent to it because my allergies are kicking up. Okay, I can. It smells kind of like alcohol. Water? Yeah, denatured alcohol is in here, so that's probably what soaks up all the oil. And then I also got Makeup Revolution. Uh, this is their Conceal and Define. Um, up. I did test it out in, in the store with their tester, and this is shade C1, okay. and this one actually looked like it matched me pretty good, because I kind of like go with a lighter shade under my eyes, because I've got, I don't know if you can really see it, I've got some dark circles under there. Don't mind my makeup, it's like 8 o'clock at night, so I've been up since about 4.30. So this is their concealer. Um, where can I put that? So 
don't know how well that's showing up on camera, but um, I did test it out in the store, and I didn't have any makeup wipes in the store to take it off with. Um, I did bother to ask. And uh, when I got home, it, I had to get a, a makeup wipe to <laughs> get it off my arm. Um, and this one was concealer. This was seven dollars. Um, and because I bought those two and it came to $15, I got a freebie, free gift. I got Makeup Revolution Fierce's Fire Palette. And <laughs> I can't read that. That's too <laughs> small for my old eyes. Um, I can't see that. That's way too small. Um, but it looks like there's a couple of highlighters and some eyeshadows. See if I can get this open. Now I did get a Makeup Revolution um, eyeshadow palette that I really wasn't thrilled with. I may not be thrilled with this one because I can't open it. Oh, go get me a knife, please. I can't open it because it's taped together. So it doesn't matter, just something to cut this with. So um, this was free. I'm still trying to see. Makeup palette. It doesn't give any colors. Um, highlighters. Shades 111 and 12. Okay, so highlighter, highlighter, high. Oops, sorry, I should do this where you can see. Highlighter, highlighter, highlighter. Um, scissors. Hopefully. Yes. Yay, it's open. Do not do that. Go put this back, please. I'll do something for Um. Okay, so highlighter, 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 because it says highlighter uh, shades 111 and 12. So these two, and then that one. So let me get my makeup wipes. Back clean my little fingers. So the first highlighter feels pretty smooth. There it is on my finger. And, oh wow, I like that one. That one's pretty stunning. And then we're gonna go into the brown one, or gold, or whatever color. Again, about the same consistency. That one's more like a bronzer, my gosh. It's pretty dark. I don't think I'd be using that one on myself. And then the gold colored one. It's on my finger. And so they're they are pretty good colors. Pretty good pay out there. And then we have I'm going to assume that shade two I'm assuming all of these other ones are just eyeshadows um, because it doesn't say anything else because it just gives colors you know what their ingredients are so it just says pigment ingredients I guess shade two is also I guess this also is a uh, highlighter if I'm reading it correctly so yes I already cleaned my fingers so there it is on my finger Those are the highlighters. Would you go grab me a paper towel? Be careful so you don't knock the lamp over. I have a makeshift lamp up there. <laughs> I brought it in from the yes. other room. Sorry. Needed a drink. It smells like that too. Okay, wonderful. This one dry my arm. Okay, so going into, I'm going to start at the top. Just go bam, 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 bam. So first one, and these are actually pretty soft. It's pretty light. It's kind of like a light peachy color. So there's that one. And I wish this 
one bad thing I wish they had names. That one um, is also kind of like a, a metallic or a shimmer. This next one is a matte. So there's that one. That one doesn't really have too much payoff. It's just a, like I said, a matte peach color. And then the next one is going to be kind of like a bronzy brown color. Uh, Real nice neutral shade. Yeah. I have a feeling these ones are going to have a lot of fallout when I use them with a brush. Because the other palette did, but, you know, it, 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 can, it can be worked with. And I just went into this one. And again, this one is kind of a shimmery color. Ooh, that's kind of pretty. Is it? I like that one. Ooh. Maybe. A seal of approval. And then this one here. That's also kind of a shimmer color. And then this is kind of a kind of a mauvey color. I can think color. <laughs> I'm getting into these darker ones here. So this one. And there's that color. And again, I wish they had names, but they don't. I think that one was also a matte and this bottom one, which looks like it's got a ton of fallout. <laughs> yeah, lots of fallout. What is that one? It is a pretty color. Is we'll just have to find out if they blend. Fallout means that the powder falls off the either your finger or off your brush while you're applying it. And then last but not least is this no, kind of an orangey color. Ooh, that's pretty. I like that orange. So that is the Makeup Revolution Fierce Aspire palette. This was my freebie for spending $15 in Makeup Revolution makeup. So clean the arm again because this next one is the one that I'm really excited about. Me too. Her too. Which one did you get, the glittery one? Yes. Yeah, yeah. I think. I don't remember. Okay, and last but not least, I got this um, no, didn't. BH Take Me Back to Brazil eyeshadow palette. I got this because of the colors. The colors look sensational. What so does that mean? That's just the Unicarton. It's got 35 colors plus pigments. I don't know if these have names or not. No names. What is that about? Um, yeah, again, another one with no names, but look at those colors. Holy crap. <laughs> I really, really wanted these colors. Looks like possibly a combination of both matte and shimmer. Um, I've been dying to try that sunset look, so I can achieve it. I'm just trying to tell here if there's Isabel. Anything I can't say goodbye. <sighs> yes, I'm looking right now. <laughs> anyway, so let's take a look at these and I'm gonna start going this way. So Here's the first one. It's kind of a pink color, and they are very soft. It's very light. So there's, box. you don't need a juice box. So there's that first one. Second pink. Getting just a little bit darker as they go.
that one seems like it. I think these ones are going to work really good with blending. Interesting. Oh, and I guess I should have told you, um, this palette was $18. What? Um, so far, um, I like it. And here is the, here, that's a really bright pink. I like that one. Yeah, I like that one. That one's real pretty. And then coming over here. That is intense. Now for my Christmas list, Jeffree Star's Blood Sugar Palette is on my Christmas list. I want it. <laughs> You're going to probably get you that. Okay, and which finger am I on here? Now we're kind of getting into more of the red, you know, deeper reds. Uh, I don't think I'm going to have room on my arm for 35 colors. <laughs> we're trying. We'll, 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 we'll go as far as we can. And then... a red, it's like a real red. So there it is on the finger. Wow, that is intense. It looks like blood. It looks like blood. <laughs> but yeah, um, I think I'm really liking this palette and yes, I'm going to be using it tomorrow. Looks like there's a little bit of fallout with this red one. <laughs> Not too, too bad. This is kind of like a brick red and it's almost like a shimmer. Alarm. I think I have a little patch of dry skin there. Ow. Let me get a new Ow. wipe. Because now I'm getting into the yellows and the oranges and greens and all of that, so I want all my clean fingers. Okay, so we're going to start here. This pretty yellow. This is the one that kind of drew me in because it's really nice intense yellow. Um, that is why I, that's the reason I got this palette. I loved that yellow and I can't wait to try it. Next one is kind of a orange color. pretty too. Yeah, here's an orange, orange. Hi, Peter. That's going to look awesome with the sun, in a sunset. This one, this orange seems a little bit patchy, but we'll have to just work with it and see what happens. Okay, and now kind of a Almost a gold color. There. That one is really shimmery. Back up to the top into this kind of a lime yellow color. And there's that one. That one's kind of a light color. It's doesn't look like it's showing up really well on the camera from what I'm seeing, but it's it's a very pretty color. And then into this light green. Which is also very pretty. I really wanted these bright colors. So when I saw these, I was like, mm -hmm, yep, mama's getting them. Okay, now we're going to go into this dark yellow here. So there's that one. Is on the arm. I guess I have her seal approval. I'm not exactly sure what you would call 
this color. Poop color. It's not poop color. <laughs> it's childish. Yeah. I think poop is brown. It is not brown. It's kind of a almost a khaki color, I guess. Oh, it's yeah. hard to see on from what I'm seeing in the viewer here. Tell me that color. I'm running out of room. We're gonna have to go to the front of the arm. Got my arm. Okay, so now where are the greens? There's this one. It's pretty. It's a very pretty, I don't know what type of green to put, like a, almost like a chameleon green. It's pretty. Not that it's like changes ships or anything, but it's like the color of a chameleon. Here's the next green. And that one's real pretty too. That's shimmery. Green. And then this nice grass green. Don't mind my funny faces when I'm trying to figure out where to put these on my arm. That one's a real pretty color too. They're all pretty, what can I say? That's why I bought it. Except for the black. Okay, and then down here is the army green? Shimmer army yeah, green? Yeah, army green. Army green. Army green. Not very dark, but it's it's still pretty. pretty. It's really shimmery. And now coming up into the blues. Gotta figure out which one I use. So, nice little baby blue. Wow. That is very blue. I like that. Very pretty, too. a turquoise teal color in between. That one I think would look really pretty in a uh, under the eye. I mean on top of the eye? <sighs> no, under the Did eye. Did I hear one? No, under. Is it, is it under the and eye? And then this one is kind of a, I think this one's probably getting more into the teal because it's more of a blue-green. <laughs> so there's that one. And then this last green one here. And not really a whole lot of pigment in that one. It's not bad. We only had room, Mom. Yes. I'm completely out of room on my arm now. Can you twist your arm backwards like this, Mom? <laughs> yeah, I can't twist my arm that way. I can. Well, I might be able to... I think I can get... There's only two more rows. We'll try. We'll see how colorful I can get my arm. Okay, so here is the dark okay, blue. Yeah. So what are you doing, big girl? Break my arm to show you guys this. <laughs> and these ones are getting darker blues into purpley colors. There's this one. So far, the pink's my favorite. Uh, well, that's because your favorite color is pink. And purple. Don't that one purple. is kind of a smoky gray blue color. I'm like military blue. Purple. I'll show you the colors. And that one's a purpley blue. Hey, I said I'll do that. You're allowed to do that. Yes, I am. I have fingers. I am so sorry about my nasally sounding voice. I'm, my allergies are just kicking in and not horrible. And then this nice dark blue here. Break your arm. 
behind mom. There's those ones. And now for the last row. Mm -hmm. So now we're going into those purples. Here's the first one. Whoa. And That's a big bug. The next one looks like a... This one looks more blue than purple, but... Oh, it's that? a walking stick. We have a walking stick on our window up here. Ugly. So there's that one. Yeah, that's, that's comes out more of a purple one. color. It's pretty. And then the last two, we have this purple. Which is there. That is an intense purple. <laughs> and I'm just going to use my pinky for this last one. <laughs> there is the last color for no the shadows. Don't forget the white in the back. Don't forget so. the white in the back, Mama. Alright, okay. I guess I have to show you the white and the black. I might have a little bit of room somewhere on my arm. Maybe on the back of my hand. We can do the back of my hand. So I don't think those are cleaned up. Okay, so there's the first white one. I think that's kind of a shimmery color. So there's that one. And these this these whites I think would be like a transition shade. We're going to go into this one over here, which is, again, kind of a off-white almost. Almost like a green-white. Those. Nice I like the second one better. And then this black one. Well, that's dark. <laughs> and I'm sure you guys saw that fallout. <laughs> so black has quite a bit of fallout. <laughs> so there you have it. There's the rainbow 35 cut. colors <laughs> on my arm. <gasps> wow, rainbow arm. Rainbow arm. So that's it for today, guys. You know, I'm sorry. I Got it to 31 minutes, 32 minutes. <laughs> I just can't do short ones for some odd reason. I'll go through this and see about editing it and shorting it up a little bit. So I'm sure you guys are getting sick of these half hour videos. But anyway, so there you have it. There's my little YouTube Hello. or my little Alta haul tonight, and my dog's barking. Okay, so bye. you guys be good to each other, be good to yourselves, and have a great evening. Bye. Mm -hmm.